Shalom, shalom. Once again, Shabbat shalom. Mr. Cop, all praise to you for another beautiful Shabbat day. Getting ready to get it started. Give you all his praise and just do service that he has commanded us to do. And we ask that y'all sing along, enjoy, you know, the celebration of Yahuwah, the celebration of life, the celebration of everything he has put in front of us. And all we got to do is just be obedient, do what he saved for us to do. And truly, man, everything else will fall in line. That's why he says, seek ye first the kingdom. And everything else will be added unto us. So definitely, all praise to him once again. The birds are chirping and got it going on out here in this beautiful afternoon or morning just about to be afternoon about to be noon day so today just continue to give people those words of encouragement continue to look towards the hill from which come your help for truly your help do come from your hood no matter what's going on in our life certain things that we cause on ourselves certain things that he allowed just to build us up this walk is about repetition. It's a workout. It's a spiritual and physical workout that we do to continue to move forward towards that mark of the high calling, as Shaul, who they call Paul, said and stuff. And so we just got to continue to press on because he said he press on. And anytime you, you press an on, that means something is in front of you. But the thing is, just keep on pressing because guess what? Little by little, you'll meet it. You'll get there. And I love it when they say it's not given to the swift. Or the strong. That's that, those are key words. Not get, it ain't about you being fast. It's not being about you being strong. But uh, can you endure? That's the thing. Endurance. Endurance don't mean that you're strong. It don't mean that you're fast. It's just that you continue to press on, and that's what it's all about, people. So I want y'all to continue to hold your head up, and we got to lean on one another. You who have put us here, of course we depend on him. But he put us here to be our brothers' keepers to help one another to lean on one another. As I said before, if, we, if we're both down at the same time, all we gotta do is put our backs against each other and push up and guarantee you'll come up together. So until then, y'all, a hubba talk, which is love you, stay strong in the faith, continue to get with those that are positive and stay away from those that are negative. Shalom, shalom. Oh, back, one more thing, just to show you life in itself. And I always talk about the garden that um, Yahuwah have blessed us to even start. Little by little, these things were planted as a little seed. And what he say? One plant and one watering. But he the one that's gonna get an increase. So it is with our daily life. This is us. This garden is us. In the earth, it's the soil that he put us in. And he's a, he expects us to grow. And how we do we grow? by his word, that daily bread. We got to get your daily bread. And so when you think about when you planting and you growing your garden and you nourishing in church and you do that, same thing with the word. That word is our fertilizer. It's that living water within. And when we do that, it's gonna be him that give us the increase to continue to grow in him, no matter what we go through. And yeah, we are gonna need some pruning. That way some more fruits can be produced so is it with the garden. So always remember, when you're in that garden, look at yourself. For that garden is truly you growing within the garden of your hood. So until then, y'all, shalom. Yeah, so yeah, we're gonna have, you know, other people that they be here, but normally they be, some of them be on the side because they camera shy. Let me see, all right. Some of the brothers and sisters pulling up now. We got the Lewis family, the Thompson. Thomas family, they all coming in, so uh so I be right back, y'all. Shalom, shalom. Shabbat shalom, Mr. Cop. Shabbat
zone. <laughs> well, you got one all right. Let's go, come on. I'm a soldier. Oh, yes. I'm
Sim, é só um pouco. Sim, é muito bom.
Thank you. 
Anybody got anything to say? We got a request. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> What's the request? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Save me, 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 save me,
We don't know ourselves before we react that you. We are our friend. Death not that you have turned our face away from us. And have mercy on us. So forgive us of all sins and iniquities and transgressions. And forgive us the sins of our ancestors. And remove that that is not right in us. And instill in us the right thing. Instill in us a clean heart and renew a right spirit. Keep us rooted in the ground. Plant like a tree next to the river of running water. Make us to be one with you and help us to guard the law, statute, judgment, and command. And cap your angels around us. Build up a hedge around us. Protect us from the wicked spirit and the wicked one himself and all enemies. Continue to give us strength and patience to move forward in you, our reward, and help us to be able to endure. Our reward, help us to be a help one to another, to be our brother's keeper, to look out for the widows and the fathers. Our reward, continue to give us understanding and wisdom of your word and the great memory of it. Keep us in good health and our right state of mind. Continue to heal those that are sick and ill. Bless the homeless with shelter, the hungry with food, and the naked with clothing. Our reward, remember those, our reward, who are struggling. Remember those who are comforters, that you will comfort them, our reward, that you will encourage them. That you will build them up with a torn down, that you will strengthen them with a weak. Father, you will, we pray that, Father, that you will continue to keep us in unity with one another, and that we continue to prepare the way for those that are coming, Father, you will. Help us to be that help one towards another, Father, you will, and to be a light and example to others. Put in our mouth the words that speak unto the scattered sheep of y'all all, and awaken your people out of their sleep and slumber. Stir them up, Father, you will, and instill in them a repent of heart, Father, you will, change them from their wicked way. Father, you will make that you also touch the leaders of your hood throughout the four corners. That they do the right thing and treat people right. But for those that won't, Father, you will replace them with someone that will. Father, you will, those that are not right for us, remove them. And those that are right for us, bring them forward, Father, you will, to be around us. That that you surround us with wise counsel and give us the ear that with us as the spirit, Father, you will. That we be so careful to continue to be praised and esteemed. That that you will comfort those that are mourning the death of a loved one, soothe their pain and hurt and feel them more in their life. And we'll be so careful to continue to give you praise in this thing. This we ask in your name. Amen. Amen. I count it as a blessing. 